Hey everybody, Stopmaster here. Uh, looks like we got a new update to Pokemon Go. So we got version 0.129.1. This is gonna give us some pretty good quality of life updates in the game. So stay tuned, we're gonna get into it in a minute. So let's talk about this new update that we have in Pokemon Go. So we got lots of new functionality with searching. So this is searching through Pokemon. See how I've now categorized my number? We now can reverse search for number. We can reverse search through recent. This is my most recent Pokemon, Horsey, that I caught today. I have my reverse. So this is the, the oldest Pokemon that I have. And as you can see on the screen, it has a little tag next to it showing that it was caught on July 12th, 2016. This is good for all of your 2016 and all of your 2017 Pokemon are gonna have this tag. So it's gonna be good so you can easily see that while trading. If somebody does not have 10 luckies, uh, you can see what Pokemon are in the 2016s or from 2016, so you can even guarantee yourself a lucky. Again, we got the name. You can also do the reverse name. So I have a ja bunch of Japanese names. So you can see Zubat and Zapdos. Okay, so this is a very good quality of life update for us for search functionality by Pokemon. Then, what we've all been asking for is search functionality for your friends list. I got nicknames, A to Z, reverse nicknames, A to Z. You got your regular names, A to Z. Here's the reverse names, A to Z. Friendship level. Here's my best friends. Here are my no no uh, no friendship levels. So you can search everybody by your regular way, top to bottom, and now bottom to top. So this is something we've all been asking for. This is absolutely fantastic. Uh, this is going to be a great addition to the game. Um, again, a best the best quality of life upgrade that we could have ever got in the game so far we're getting it right now this is awesome so this is again version 0.129.1 functionality has been drastically increased for us here in the game this is absolutely fantastic um, i'm loving this update already i downloaded the apk directly to my phone since it is, may not be available in all google play stores and or all apple uh stores as of right now so Look on the look out for this update. This will be out relatively soon. Um, this is absolutely great. Again, I'm loving this uh, new functionality for the search features and the extra thing that they did with the older Pokemon 2016 and 2017. All right, guys, get out there and enjoy this uh, update. Uh, please stay tuned to the rest of this video. All right, so those new raid bosses have now been released into the game. Today's the 23rd. So for the next three days, we will have uh, new level three raid bosses. We have Raichu uh, adding in as a, as a raid boss in addition to his Alolan form. Then we have all the EV illusions. So we have Jolteon, Vaporeon, Flareon, Espeon, and Umbreon as level three raid bosses. Also, a low end executor has been moved from a level two to a level four raid boss. So go out there, get some raids done. I'm going to personally do some Vaporeons because I have a grudge against them from when I could not solo it. So I'm going to start soloing Vaporeons. So I'll bring those to you once I get them. All right, guys, enjoy raiding. So in addition to the changes to the scrolling for friendships and Pokemon, uh, the data miners found a new December event, so this should be happening probably middle of December or so, towards the end of December. We don't know what uh, the specifics are as of yet. Maybe they released Deli Bird again, because uh, some people who are back into the game haven't gotten one because it was just released last December. Uh, people are looking to get one lucky. Luckily, I have one lucky already, so I didn't have to worry about that too much. Um, but who knows? We'll see what happens with that. Let's, let me know in the comments what you think. Uh, the uh, what the event's gonna entail for uh, Christmas? Maybe you know Santa Hat Pikachu comes out again. Uh, that would be cool to find one of those shining, possibly. Um, so either way, uh, 
also, they uh, just released last night that Raichu, um, Alone in Raichu, can be found shiny in raids now. So I'm going to post a picture up on screen, what he looks like, but Alone in Raichu is now available in a shiny form out of raids, just like Alone in Marowak. So I'm assuming sometime soon they'll be releasing Alone in Executor as a shiny as well. That could also mean Execute could become shiny event uh, in the next couple of months maybe. Um, who knows? We'll see what happens. But hope you guys enjoyed today's video about the update. Uh, if you did, don't forget to stomp that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. We'll see you guys in the next one.